NFL draft was a few weeks ago, and many players from the borderland, UTEP in specific, did not hear their name called. The majority of them still waiting to sign with the team as an undrafted free agent. But if they're looking for motivation, see this man, Roy Robertson Harris, as an example. He's the latest UTEP success story, taking the NFL by storm. And if you don't know Roy now, you will soon. We all know of Aaron Jones' success in the NFL, but another former UTEP miner is earning quite the reputation in the oh, NFC North. Who's 95? He just keeps showing up over and over. Tony Romo isn't wrong because Roy Robertson Harris is everywhere when he's on the field. And you might be asking yourself who 95 is because on a defensive line with the likes of pro bowlers Khalil Mack, Akeem Hicks, and newly acquired Robert Quinn, Robertson Harris plays about 50% of the snaps. But Roy doesn't care about being overlooked. He was coming out of UTEP where he starred from 2012 to 2015 a three-year starter in El Paso and jumping off the tape week after week, Roy went undrafted in 2016, signing with the Bears as a free agent. You know, you see a lot of other guys from other big, you know, from big schools, um, you know, they're spread out. So the handful of us that are from UTEP and are in the NFL, you know, it's a blessing to be able to put UTEP on the map. Um, in three years in Chicago, Robertson Harris has seven and a half sacks, but when he's on the field, you know it. The pressure rate on opposing quarterbacks is way higher when Roy is on the field compared to when he's off. And with matchups against Tom Brady and Aaron Rodgers lined up this year, Roy is already looking forward to applying the heat. The fact that we are playing Brady, I am excited. I got to play against him in 2018. Fullback Devlin. Uh, had a hit on him, so that was pretty cool. Uh, Rodgers, I've sacked a couple times and been able to get, get back there a few times. So it's always, it's always exciting to play against those guys, guys that you've watched since you were a kid. As far as his old college teammate in Green Bay, Aaron Jones, it's a little more fun meeting in the trenches. I know everything that Aaron's going to do, and he's still going to do it, even if I'm prepared. Once the game is done, then it's back to the, hey, you know, that's my dude from El Paso, you know, but when it's game time, we just locked in and it's just, a, it's just a logo on the helmet and a number on the jersey, that's all. Despite becoming a fan favorite in Chicago, it is fair to wonder whether Roy could see more snaps and more money elsewhere. But for Robertson Harris, he's loyal to the team that took a chance on the kid from UTEP in 2016. You know, this is the team that brought me in and, and trusted in me to, um, you know, make the roster at, you know, my first year and then contribute throughout these, you know, past couple years. So I'm not... I'm not down on anything, you know, when I, whenever my time is, my time will come. Um, so right now I'm just being patient. There's no rush to, to get, you know, out of Chicago and, and go get a, you know, a big contract. I'm, right now I'm just thinking about ball. And with the talent around him, the spotlight will only increase. Could Chicago's defense be the best in the league? Oh, absolutely. Um, but if you, if you know football, if you watch football, everybody knows it. I'm not kidding. They love Big Roy in Chicago. I got my customized 9-5 jersey on back order. Roy's a free agent after this season. He just signed his one-year tender. He told me that there was interest from a number of other teams, but he's loyal to the team that gave him a shot. And he has a second child on the way here soon, so an exciting time for Roy Robertson-Harris. Pay close attention.